The sequencing process starts when a sample of DNA is cut up into millions of fragments. Each fragment then attaches to its own bead and is copied until it covers the bead. This automated process covers millions of beads with millions of different fragments. These beads then flow across the chip, each depositing into a well. Then the chip is flooded with one of the four DNA nucleotides. Whenever a nucleotide is incorporated into a single strand of DNA, a hydrogen ion is released. This is how the ion torrent system sequences DNA, by reading this chemical change directly on the chip. The hydrogen ion changes the pH of the solution in the well. An ion-sensitive layer beneath the well measures that change in pH and converts it to voltage. This voltage change is recorded, indicating that the nucleotide was incorporated and the base was called. In essence, each well works as the world's smallest pH meter. The process is repeated every 15 seconds with a different nucleotide washing over the chip. This process happens simultaneously in millions of wells. So regardless of whether you're using a chip with 1 million wells or 1 billion, the sequencing process takes only a few hours, a fraction of the time that it would take for traditional light-based sequencers.